Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. This is HiPhone Pro. Uh, I'm here because uh, not too long ago we started a new website, touchswipe.com, and it's built and made for all the touchscreen devices. Any device you can think of with a touchscreen, that's what we want to deal with. And since uh, we've opened, we've had a lot of support, and we now have several touchscreen apps and games, tips and tricks, just about everything you could want or need for touchscreen devices and we're looking for more people with more devices to come on down and share what you have with us. Uh, here's what we have for you today. Um, I have something truly amazing that I think everybody's going to love today. It's a, it's a trick that we've discovered down at touchswipe.com and it's, uh, it's fascinating, phenomenal to say the least. Uh, what we have done, we discovered it by accident, is found a way to turn your touchscreen computer or touchscreen laptop into an iPhone style and it's very easy to do. Um, now what I'm going to show you is is just awesome. I mean as you can see down here we've got the dock. It's typical of Windows 7 and up here we have the icons and as you can see they're a lot larger than usual. Now if I put my finger down here I can scroll through my desktops a lot like the iPhone or the iPad just by going back or forth just like this uh, now you probably recognize this this is the same thing an iPad or an iPhone does now also the the beauty of this is it can be done in, in a landscape here let me keep the camera sideways but still just to give you an idea so when you turn your your computer into a tablet you know, you've got practically an iPhone, basically, or an iPad, as you want to call it. So it's, it's the same thing. Now, uh, you're probably wondering, okay, well, now how do I do it? Which is usually the question. Well, my number one answer to, to give you the easiest way to do it is to come down to touchswipe.com and, uh, and do a search, and you'll find it, or I'll leave a link there in the right. And I, while we're on the video, I'm going to give you a brief explanation of how we do it. Okay, number one... What you do is you just right click on the desktop, you'll see where it says view here, go to view, and as you notice I no longer have medium icons, I just you know, naturally set it to large icons, that's why they're bigger, easier to touch. Okay, and that's easy enough, and the second is I'm using an application, it's called Dexpo, or Depo, I'm not sure how you pronounce that, D-E-X-P-O-T, and it's freeware. And with this application, what you can do is basically add multiple desktops, plain and simple. And you can configure your icons very easily. Uh, let me just show you how to do that. It's real easy. Let's see. Configure Windows. And you choose which, you know, let's go to Icons. And then you can choose, let's say, Calculator, and I want to have that on, on Window 2. I'd right-click Calculator, go to Move, it asks me which window, 2. Okay, now that's on Window 2, and close that. Now you can see the calculator is no longer on this desktop, so let's go to Window 2. Oh, well, it's not there either. I'm not sure why. Oh, there it is. This must be Window 2. <laughs> But anyway, as you can see, very easily and quite simply, we have changed a Windows 7 touchscreen computer into basically an iPad. So obviously the iPad isn't all that great. You know, it's not something that can't be done with the new touchscreen computers all in all, at least as far as the user interface is concerned. So anybody who has a touchscreen computer and wants to know how to do this, wants more of a, an iPhone style, for desktops, come on down to touchswipe.com and we're going to hook you up. Uh, another thing I want to squeeze in here while we're on the subject anyway is um, one of our moderators, um, Jolly Wombat, who is also a moderator over at Touch, um, Touch Smart Dev Zone, has created an application uh, for the Touch Smart software for the TX2Zs. A lot of people with TX2Z1000 and before that uh, did not get the Touch Smart uh, applications. They got the Media Smart, which was kind of a ripoff. Everybody else with the PC version of Touch Smart and with the 
TX2Z 1300 and above all got touch smart and the TM2s are all going to have it. So we didn't get the Hulu applications or anything like that. So he went ahead and uploaded the application on his website and he also left a link at touchswipe.com if you want to get it there. But just to give you an idea of what the touch smart applications is, I'm going to give you just a quick interview on this or a quick review. If I can open it up there. And you probably recognize it. And most people with a newer TX2Z, um, they're not going to care because they have this already. And uh, the beauty of this is he made this in an all-in-one installer. So you don't have to download several different apps. You just go to his app and it will. you click which um, apps you want to install with the installer and it will install all of them for you. So just to give you an idea, um, you can't see very well because it's so bright. Let me see if I can amend the screen here. There we go. You know, you've got your, your camera, webcam, video, uh, what's that? Let's see, DVD, Canvas, Rebound, Notes, um, you know, things like that. But you probably recognize this, and it really is a wonderful app. I, I really wasn't going to review this, but I'm just squeezing it in here just to give you an idea. Just to give you, here's the Hulu app, just to kind of show you. And it, it's got Twitter. There's Twitter. Um, and it really is a spectacular app. And, and this guy, Jolly Wombat, is just an amazing developer to have, to have done what he's done here and just create a, a, an installer for everybody. And uh, he did it in a period of time that was just amazing. So that's all we've got for you. And uh, come on down to touchswipe.com, and you're going to know how to turn your, your touchscreen Windows 7 computer into a, basically an iPod, iPad or an iPhone and also come and get the new TouchSmart uh, applications install, installer. That's all we got for you. Thanks again for watching my channel. If you like what you see here, please um, subscribe and also if you like the video, please don't forget to rate it. Thanks YouTube. Thanks TouchSwipe.com and have a great day.